Know Your Episode, Volume 1, Gemini, Gemini vs. Quill, Your Enemies Arrived, Time Is Now. It's the Don't Flop Champion, Quill, Know Your Enemy, let's get into it. If Hollywood made a movie about your life, who would play the lead role? Denzel Washington, what would you choose as your last meal on death row? I can't saltfish. If you could only eat one cuisine for the rest of your life, what would it be? You know what, I'm tempted to say Mexican, you know. But Italian, I feel like Italian is more practical. If you can get rid of any one city, which would it be and why? Manchester. Oh, really? Yeah, I want to get... You've been trying to get rid of yeah, Manchester, Donnie's, yeah, to be fair. Yeah, yeah. it's my, my long-term beef with, 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 with all of them. Koji lives there. What's, the, so. what's your problem with the man you look? Like, don't know, they're just my battle rap enemies, don't know. it's just fun. They give you the nice ones. Outside of London, what is your favourite city in the world? Well, they can't ask you because you don't battle outside of London. What would be your, your superpower? Would you rather have Linguini Linguistics or Holy Shoulder Blades? <laughs> <laughs> yes, sticking with the Italian carbs, we'll say Linguini Linguistics. Name three uses of a stapler apart from stapling. Say that now you, name three uses of a staple apart from being stapled. A staple? You could use it as a mini bridge for like um, really small people, yeah? Uh, Terrible, you, no. Who would you say from a burning building, Shuffle T or Marla? Oh, you can't ask me that. No, no I'm sorry, my friend. Yeah, no, nah, man's jumping in the building go. and dying, fam. Who would you say from a burning building, Thierry Henry or Ian Wright? Ooh. I'm saving you know, Henri. I'm saving Henri. Henri yeah, right, was bro. better, but Ian Wright is like that uncle figure for Arsenal, so I'll say Ian Wright. Isn't it? If you were stuck in a room with nothing but a pen and a pad and you weren't allowed to write bars, what would you do? I'd draw boobs. Yeah, I was thinking that. If you could get drunk with any three famous people, dead or alive, who would you choose? That's dead good, or alive? That's a lit one. famous people. Uh, Eminem, just because of my kid fanboy, I have to in a lie. I he don't seem like he's a good vibe fam. Okay, what is your best personal trait? Hmm, I don't know, that's a very big added question, isn't it? Name every member of the Wu Tang Clan. Oh, I can't. I'm, I don't listen to it. Name as many as you can. I can't name any. Oh, right, that's, that's bad, isn't it? Yeah. I'll put, I, know, I would know that, but it's Tribe Called Quest in the no. I don't know. What is your gym song? I've been popping all my life. It's like my birthday every night. Who's the most famous person you've met and what do you think of them? Come on. Most famous person I've met? Oh, Say something Roberto nice. Carlos, mate. Say something nice about him. Yeah, he was lovely. He was, he was actually really nice. What's the most embarrassing thing that's happened to you recently? Recently? A uh, man fainted. What is the nicest thing you've ever done for someone? Nicest thing I've ever done for someone? Fuck, you know, I don't know. Because uh, you're, you're a piece of shit. I remember someone I uh, uh, used to work with, he, he lived at the, at the place and he didn't have anything, so I gave him a TV and a computer. What's your favourite thing about me, Jem? I like this question. Confidence and delusion mixed together, <laughs> which is like my favourite thing about you. What is the biggest misconception about you? Probably that I'm um, egotistical. I don't think that's a misconception. What are three things you want to do before you die? What well, three things you want to do before November the 5th? I'd like to go to the darts, that would be a good laugh. Who would win out of us two in a fight to the death? I'm fucking your shit. <laughs> you know I'll smoke you, bro. Oh my god, bro, I love it. Who would you rather be stuck with in a zombie apocalypse, me or her, and why? Oh, you, bro. Yeah, I was not gonna do nothing. Rowan's gonna be trying to call Jake's <laughs> on, on, on yeah, the bro, zombies. Spooky, bro. You know what, yeah? I think you should fight the zombies. <laughs> no. Ruin, I'll pay you yeah. 250 yeah? If you fight the zombies one round, five minutes. Bro, Rowan's the type of guy that tries to bite you before he's even been bitten. Bro, <laughs> <laughs> chill, bro, walk off, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? Chill, bro, it's just us two, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah, Who would you love to punch in the face? Oh, bear people. I was saying this the other day. I haven't actually punched someone in the face here in so long. What is a skill you wish you had? Uh, singing or dancing. Surely rapping. Do you believe in second chances? At what? How would you tell your partner to gain weight? I would stand really far away and I'd say, babe, come over here quick. And by the time she gets there, she would have lost a bit of it already. <laughs> what triggers you? When people say like, can I ask you a question? 
because that is a question already. You didn't ask permission for that. Who is the one person you wish you'd never met? One person I wish I'd never met. It's definitely not me. I'm making your whole career. There, there, honestly, there's no one. Don't want to be corny, but there's no one. It's going to be me after there's the no fifth. No one I should never met. Got me here today to become the Don't Flop champion. After the fifth, you're going to be like, oh, I wish I never met you. Against you. After the fifth, you're going to be like, I wish I never met you. Don'tflottickets.com.